Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Poke Adventures Season 2. Today, Episode 6. 6! Kind of a little amendment episode to what we were supposed to do last time. Sorry. So it pushes Episode 6, actually what Episode 6 was, back. Um, today, we're heading out to Union Cave. You're not gonna grab what's on that tree? It's a, it's a berry I don't need. Paralyzed cure. Oh, this guy, though. Yeah, I gave him around Violet City training. Uh, he gives you... A return, I believe. No. Miracle, Miracle seed. seed. Oh! I know who could use that. You. You could use that. I don't get an item for my Pokemon until much later. No, you get the charcoal coming up in Azalea time. <gasps> Whooper! 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 Interesting thing about Whooper. Um, the Japanese name for the Pokemon is Upa. And translating, dubbing the anime from Jap Japanese to English, they didn't change how he talked. A lot of people think he's saying Wooper, he's actually just saying Oopa. Which is cute as heck. Yes. Whoopers are adorable. And they start with water gun. So And they're a water ground, which is interesting. They're water. But in Quagsire, Quagsire its evolution ground. becomes a water, water ground. ground. So if you're looking for a decent water type... Whooper's not that bad. Whooper's really not bad. Um, very limited move set, though. Yeah. I mean, you will get Earthquake by level up. True. <coughs> Excuse me. Dang. God, the way these episodes are tiered, people are think I'm, people will think I've had this cold for years. Probably. Oh, you got a Whooper. Hey, Whooper. I can't catch one because I have no Pokeballs on me. Sadly. But I will fight this Whooper so I can level up to 14. That's right. I was supposed to check. Yeah. Teams. Um, if anyone else has one coming up here in the next couple episodes. I do not. I... You might. You potentially could. What? I need a fishing rod. Where do we get the old rod? The cave coming up. You only... Cra crabbies <clears throat> you can only get with a good rod. Nope. What? It was only Magikarp's with old rod. Nope. There's a sl uh, slim chance. Well, knowing my luck, slim equals none. Well, you'll wait for that then. Um, I have one that'll probably come up. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen you around before. And we're not going to fight every trainer on screen. We're going to fight the ones that are easiest <coughs> to yeah. get to. Uh, we'll go back and grind yeah. before Union K. I think Albert was unavoidable no matter where you walked. You kind of locked eyes. I, maybe. I can't remember if he's a spinning trainer. Yeah. Oh, but he's got a Zubat. Zabgat. Zabgat. That's a character from a D&D campaign we play. Long story. Everyone calls him Zubat. Yeah. Oh, this one might have bite, though. Yay. Got right, a test confused. I don't know if it has bite. If it does, Ghastly screwed. Nope, doesn't look Ghastly. like it. Ghastly. Ghastly. Lick. Did you try licking on it? I'm really hoping I can get a Paralyze Hacks. Ooh. Yay, good job, I'm also glad they fixed that thing between Gen 1 and Gen 2 where Bug is super effective against Poison. Yeah, that was kind of messed up. That sucked. <laughs> Let's see, who am I fighting? I'm gonna start leveling up Hoot Hoot. Don't remember when Hoot Hoot evolved. 20. Yeah. <coughs> hoot Hoot. Peck. Your leech life does nothing to me. I think the rival will end up having a... A ghastly at some point. Really? Which is good for me because it'll be something ghastly is super effective against. Hey, level 10. Good job. Oh, no super mistake. fastly. Fastly. I think that. Oh god, have I found Ghastly's nickname? Fastly. fastly. I thought it was gonna be Rick Ghastly. It's 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 a female though, so it might be. Um, I think up here is a super potion. Wait, is there no, a... it's a rappel. There is a trainer. Uh, I believe she's the first instance of Nidoran. Nidoran, huh? Oh, I forgot that guy. Wah, wah. Yeah, she's the first instance of a female Nidoran in this route. Okay. And I think in the game, which is useful if you're looking to find one for your Pokedex, but I don't think you can get them until Goldenrod City. This guy's got the male Nidoran. Ah, uh, the Nidorans. That was a, uh, well, permanent fixture of your team. <laughs> that was a short-lived one on mine in Season 1. Yeah. God, the good old days. Where we were just stressed out about every Everything. Episode. Oh, there's a Paralyze. Ooh, I found a Great Ball. Well, now you can attempt to catch your, uh, 
Your Pokemon if you want to try. Which one? That one in the water. That's totally a Magikarp. Okay, I mean, I'm, yeah, as much as I love Magikarp, I'm probably gonna pass. You don't want a Gyarados? No, no, no. Where are you walking to? I don't know, I thought there was an item up there, but I realized it was just connecting. And lots of whoopers. Whoopa! Especially at night. I think there's just a lot of whooper in general. I feel like it's not a nighttime specific, but it might I think be they, a nighttime specific. I don't think it's a nighttime specific, but the odds go up, I believe. Ooh, 115 points. Oh my gosh. So close! That's closer than you made your Pokemon. Probably. Close, but no Seagar. I think one of these um, fishermen up here have a Quillfish. Which is an interesting Pokemon. It was kind of a weird... Not a lot of people use it. It's... I don't think anyone used a Quillfish, in all honesty. They are rather terrible. Yeah. They're a water poison type that doesn't even get access to useful moves. It gets Hydro Pump, I know. Which is impressive for a little, you know... A puffer fish. <laughs> I imagine it just, like, goes in the water and, like, sucks in 50 feet of water <laughs> and just blows it at you. Uh, I'm gonna fight this guy's whooper while you're fighting. And then I think we're gonna head to the cave yes. and be able to call it from there, maybe? Sounds good. I'm trying to remember, did one of these fishermen have a fishing rod? Oh, we're actually we only seven minutes into the episode. Wow. We could just do Union Cave. Ooh, man. I would rather probably just push that by itself because it can get kind of long. Especially if you don't have any repels. We have a repel. A repel will not get us through Union Cave. It could. If you're really good. Depends. Okay, guy might die. Ghastly, no! I don't know. I mean, my special defense is pretty high. It's decent. And if I can just get... Oh, okay. You tell me. Whatever. Oh, no. Lady Baza's asleep. Wake up, dang it. I want Ghastly to get better moves soon. It will. <laughs> well, I mean, more so when it evolves. If but... I can get... Sh when I get Shadow Ball... That's gonna be... Oh, my God. There's gonna be no stop. That's me. such an OP move. It really is. At least I, I want Shadow Ball, I want Hypnosis, I want Dream Eater, and I think I want... We all want a lot of things, Colin. I'm gonna give him a punch. Might give him Ice Punch. I was about to say... Well, no, ice... it's gotta be Thunder Punch. Uh, because I have a Water type. Yeah. Ghastly grew to 11. Good job. Wake up, Ladybug! Come on! It will never wake up. Uh, don't say that. You will be asleep for a hundred years. Oh this is literally going to be like four or five turns. Oh, hey. Would you like to have this tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail for one million The sad Pokemon thing dollars. is the highest dollar amount you could go is nine, 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 nine. So you can never buy a slowpoke tail. There is never a, there is never a good way That's to get it. That's a hidden item. Great ball. Second great ball. Yep. So now I have two great balls. Two chances of catching... A Pokemon that I thought I was going to be able to catch, but I didn't ever encounter, I don't think. Yeah. Is it even in this grass? I don't know. It's gotta be. Who are you trying to encounter? Zubat. I'm gonna just flat out say it. Zubat is my next teammate. Well, you could probably get him in Union <clears throat> Cave. You could have caught one way back when before Violet City. They were just not coming out. I didn't have any luck. Let's see if I can find a Zubat. Well, rest assured, you're gonna find one in Union Cave. Oh, look, a Magikarp! Hello there. Uh, Zubat is in this area. He's in a lot of places. Zubat is everywhere. Holy crap, Zubat is everywhere. Zubat! He's everywhere. And nowhere at the same, same time. time. Now, Heart Gold, Soul Silver, if you remember a lot, anything about that, this route had a super mega... Oh, oh hey, look, it's a Zubat. Hey, look at that. Um, it had a super overhaul where they added in, like, the magnet train tracks. Yes, they did. And I thought that was the niftiest touch. It also had a TM for Bullet Seed, mm -hmm. which at that point in the game was, like, the best thing ever because I think the first time I played through it, I had a Hoppip. Oh. You know, I, I almost thought about catching a Hoppip. They no. are... They are terrible. Yeah. But Jump Luffs aren't... They're also kind of terrible. Not as bad as Hoppip. Uh, I think it's like Jumpluff and Whimsicott are tied for being the literally worst grass-type Pokemon out there. Second only to Carnivine. Carnivine! Dude, what was Carnivine even? A Venus flytrap. <clears throat> a but different... What was a it? Different... It was fly... Or it had levitate, didn't it? I'm pretty sure it had levitate. I don't know. 
Carnivine was a lot is a more family friendly version of Victory Bell, I guess you could say. I liked Victory Bell a lot. Uh, Pokeball. Pokeball, go! Also, that Magikarp is level 15. Yeah. That's awesome. Remember that this was the first game, by the way, that Magikarp received a move other than Tackle and Splash. Yes, it learns Flail at level 30 if he chose not to evolve him into a Gyarados. Also, I am getting nicknamed Zubat. I love his sprite. I do love that they chose to do this. <laughs> what? You know what it's gonna be? It's, oh uh, yeah. god, what is the button? It's this button. Okay, riddle me this. This guy has only a team of Magikarp. Yet he got a magic carpet level 15. Yeah. How on earth did he train it? How? Bait and switch. With just magic carp that only knows splash. How? By the way. Yeah. Is that the right way? I saw that coming. Oh, it's... wait. I think it's Zap. G H A T. G H A T? Yep. Those half orc names, they're funky. They really are. I was expecting a Q in there somewhere. No. Yep, Zapgat. For those of Zap you who Gat. follow the D&D campaign that we're part of, uh, that's a shout-out to good friend uh, Zapgat. He died, the half he came sorcerer. back. Yeah. He, died. he died pretty gruesomely. He, uh... He was shot with a uh, death beam from a beholder, fell ten stories to his death onto a marble fountain and broke every bone in his body. <laughs> As if the death beam didn't do enough already. But the thing was, he had a resurrection spell, so basically, when he was revived, he was kind of floating in the air, kind of like Beauty and the Beast style, when the Beast kind of transformed back. If you've seen Beauty and the Beast. And they watched as he, like, woke up, but he was screaming in pain as every bone was set back in place, and then he plopped to the ground. D&D is scary stuff. It is. And this fisherman has a goldeen. I'm going to take on this... I believe there's a bird trainer down here. Bird trainer. And then we should probably call it an episode. Sounds good. Gonna bring in Polyswag. Polyswag! <clears throat> a bird trainer, you say? I'll probably use Geodude against him. But what if you want to level someone else up? Who would I want to level up? We'll see. Your starter. For starters. Possibly. Chick Reed isn't going to be much use in the Azalea. It's going to be though. super use in Union Cave, though. Union Cave, yeah. So I'll, <clears throat> I'll probably save the bulk of the leveling up for then. Your Hoot Hoot is going to be super useful. Yes. Mom's calling. Hi, Mommy. Oh, she found an item for me. So you spent my money without my permission. Thanks, Mom. Well, we're nowhere near a Pokemart, so it'll have to wait. Or it's in your PC. PC. That's right. She doesn't... So I can go to the Pokemon Center and figure out what she bought me. I forgot. You know, if it's a Pokeball, I'll be okay. How would you like to have it? I didn't even... He just stopped me. Yeah, he's he's a roadblock. I want it. Oh. No, I'm not loaded. Sorry. And but then I'm, he'll disappear later. At, once the slow poke well and it's taken care of. I guess he's technically a Team Rocket member, isn't he? I don't know. With the slow poke well incident? Maybe. Unless he's just bought a slow poke tail. Unless someone hired him to... Uh, who knows? Who knows? Yes, I am out late. It's way past my bedtime, but that's okay. It's nine o'clock. It's way past everyone's bedtime. All right. Let's see what Mama got me. And then we'll call it as soon as I beat this trainer's butt. Sounds good. My PC. She got me a Ooh, super potion. Damn, Mom. I'll take that. Your mom's better than my mom. What the heck, Mom? Ah. I love you, Mom. Uh, so, in the next episode of Poke Adventures Season 2, we are going to approach the Union Cave and Union Cave. Go ahead. And take everything it has to offer. So, we will see you guys in the next video. Catch you later!